Hello, one and all, and welcome back to the Arcanine Academy. Today we're having a look at the Zashian tin, and we have the Zash Zamazenta tin to open it another time. Galarian mascots themselves. But yeah, these are some tints I've been waiting for for some time, as I'm yet to be able to pull a Zashian V, and it's such a strong uh, card in the game at the moment. Um, yeah, I mean, you can just get one of these, and you can just get one of the promos straight out of the box, quite literally. And yeah, then I guess there is also a chance you can get a number one inside if there's any sort of shield tins, uh, boosters. But yeah, to be able to just walk away with a Zashian V, I mean, it's been such a sought after card. I've not managed to get a single one. And yeah, there it is, just a card straight for the taking. I'm really happy with this. Absolutely amazing. Let me stick you up here, just like that. Okay, it's not going to go after that. But yeah, I can't believe it. You can just get a promo of one of the best cards in the game at the moment. And yeah, uh, yeah, I won't be giving away that. But because, yeah, as I say, I've been trying to get one for ages, and I just can't get one for love nor money. Well, I could buy, go out buy one, but they are expensive and. Yeah, I think for less, probably before this tin came out, you'd have to be paying more than, yeah, you'd definitely be paying more than what the tin is worth. And, yeah, this way you get the tin, the promo, and boosters as well. I mean, absolutely amazing, slightly different art, but the art is not bad in the slightest. Yeah, look at it, ready to go. That massive Brave Blade attack for 230 damage has most definitely upset me multiple times on PTCGO. But yeah, let's have a look at what we got. Two Rebel Clash, a Sword and Shield, and an Evolutions. I mean, obviously the Gold Zashian is going to be in there now just because. But here we go, Evolutions. Ah, oh, that Blastoise as well. I am very much a fan of Blastoise. For Squirtle being my very first ever uh, card. That uh, card. Um, starter. That's the word I'm looking for. But yeah, hopefully. I mean, if we could get a Charizard or a Reverse or a Charizard, that'd be quite cool. Unfortunately, there is no um, Blastoise in this set, I don't believe, apart from the. Well, I guess there's the EX one, I think. But yeah, that'd be pretty cool to get. But what have we got? We have a Revive, Slowbro Spirit Link. Super Potion, Rattata, Growlithe, my little buddy, Nita and Mail, Vulpix, Sandshrew. Ooh, Reverse Holy Pikachu, that's quite nice, at least that's something. A little throwback to the armor. Oh, I remember trading around with these cards when I was a kid. But yeah, the oh, first Hollow on these Evolutions packs. Absolutely nuts, I mean, you can always see me in it. Anyway, last one. Can it be a Charizard? Regular rare Doug Trier. Not too bad, not too bad. Could be far worse. But that's not really what we're going for today. But as I say, we can't really be mad with anything from this set, this tin, because that Zashian V promo is absolutely nuts. Um, yeah, but can we get another one? I mean, that would be quite something. I mean, not quite sure what's left in the Sword and Shield set that I'm particularly after. Obviously, the gold cards would be brilliant. But yeah, let's have a look. Switch, Ferrothorn, Reboot, Sobble, Lip Plug, Baltoy. Oh, look at that cute little Wooloo. Joltik, Reverse Hollow Grookey, and our last card. Oh, Hollow Oranguru. That is a card I did need, I have to say. Very, very nice. And yeah, once again, a very playable card and used in quite a lot of decks at the moment. Especially that Turbosation deck, which I think actually has just done really well in the Limitless Tournaments. Uh, yeah, using it to put a card on top of your deck from your hand and drawing another card, so it gets you out of trouble. If you need a slightly different card and you can hope it's on the top of your deck, if not, yeah, what it does is place the card on top of your deck. And loads of people have been putting Jirachi Prism Star on top of their deck and using Mr. Mime to put it into their prize cards. And that obvious, and um, 
Jirachi Prism still has an amazing effect where if you draw it as your prize card, you can play it straight to your bench and take another prize card, which can be devastating. A Steel Energy, Phalanx, Palpitoad, Capture, Shinx, Sandy Ghast, Rayricoli, Stunky, Clefairy. Oh, yes! Oh, I've been wanting this for so long. Verse Hollow Boss's orders. There we go. Oh, wow. Haven't got one yet. Opened up a whole, well, everything on the channel so far, and we still haven't got one. I am over the moon with that. Not quite sure which is more sought after the hollow or the first hollow. I tend to find reverse hollows are rarer, but and harder to get because you're not always guaranteed a rare. But I do really want the hollow at some point. And that full art one looks amazing. And our last card, <laughs> Red or Rare Farascuda. But Boss's Orders. I'm definitely going to be playing around with that card. Just to be able to gust, it's going to be so playable. It's quite expensive at the moment. Yeah, there we go. Last pack, Rebel Clash. Can we follow it up for something else? And it's been quite a good tin. But can we come away with a V? A V would be great. Just a little, just to top it off. But that may be a tad greedy. But we can hope, guys. We can hope. One, two, three, four. But yeah, I mean, oh, those gold cards in the set as well. I haven't pulled a single gold card. But I guess gold cards aren't actually really hard to get. What have we got? Dark Energy, Didi, Charger Bug, Metapod, Mr. Mime, Gallopy, Barbocha, Aracuda, Stufel, Ooh, Reverse Hollow Lampant with that top entry ability. And our last card, can it be something? A little last pack magic. It's a Hollow Stone Joiner. Not the best card, not the most amazing card, but it is a hollow nonetheless, and we are happy with hollows. But, yeah, not a little bad, not too bad at all. But, little recap, guys. We have, obviously, oops, I don't throw it everywhere. That Zashian V promo, this whole tin has been about. I am so happy to have one and be able to play around with it. And it's quite a cool card. How its eyes shine. But, yeah. From the packs, we have that Stone Joiner Hollow, Guru Hollow, and Boss's Orders Reverse Hollow. Really cool cards. Some really playable cards. I don't know if Stone Joiner is in much, but yeah, really happy of that. Oh well. Uh, let me know if you managed to get hold of these tins. I've got them a little bit late, unfortunately, but yeah, did you manage to get anything out of yours? Is this something you were looking to pick up? And yeah, are you thinking of playing the game to make any Zashian V decks after this? Just the fact that they'll be so much more easier to get. Alright, well, thank you for watching, and yeah, I hope that you enjoy the rest of the time. And until the next videos, we shall see you then. All the best.